So I don't know if it's because my muscle relaxers haven't uh, worn off and the ones that I took in the middle of the night to sleep. Um, but my back feels okay right now. And uh, Carolyn invited me to do some geocaching, which I hear that term said all the time. But to be honest with you, I have no idea what it really means. <laughs> so let's see, hopefully it doesn't in, uh, tail me hiking up mountains or lifting up rocks. <laughs> What's this called? A compass. I'm following a compass. <laughs> and it's telling me how far I am away from it. So I'm using another phone because you can't use the app and the camera at the same time. So it's this direction. What is a geocache anyways? It's where somebody has hidden something and it's like a you have to go find it. It's a uh, it's a hobby that people do and sixteen feet. Jimmy, we're getting close. <laughs> Are we going back the same way we came? <laughs> we're following the um, the uh, compass. So it's an actual physical object that we're looking for. Okay. Okay, we're eight feet away from it. So, you have to... Now we're six feet away from it. Seven feet. And it's not buried in the ground. Well, it can be. Yes. Oh, that's challenging. And I'm thinking, according to... Okay, now we're five feet away. Three feet. Oh, oh, oh. Oops. See, I think it's under this tree. Or it can be in the tree, too. Oh, my. So look for something. Um, now it says I'm five feet and I haven't moved. Let's see. Oh! The trees are poking me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have my glasses on and that is not helping me. Okay, so we are looking for, oh, now it says three feet. Seven feet. <laughs> yeah, it's... It's not an exact thing. <laughs> So it said one foot when you were here, right? I found it. This looks I found it, but it is not where it says it was. Okay, cool. Since you found it, you get to... It looked very conspicuous, this pile of rocks. Pills. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pill bottle. And and one thing about geocaching is there's a log in there which we sign. Oops, sorry guys. I gotta take my phone off this. 
thing so I can actually, there we go. It's a, uh, a log and we sign it. <laughs> and what is it? Oh, cute! It's a little army man <laughs> and a little bracelet or yeah. something like a bracelet. It's like a tiny bracelet mm -hmm. and a little googly eye guy. Oh, yeah, okay, so there's three things. A pet there. rock. <laughs> yeah, and let's see, where's the, the, um, the log? I brought a pen, and let's There's see. two of them. Oh, two. Wow, a lot of people have found this. So that one is um, full on both sides? Yes, it is. Okay, let's see what the latest date, oh, February 8th. Oh, I know who it was. Hike with me found this, <laughs> um, Carol. day before yesterday. Ah. So now we get to sign it. This is really fun. This goes back quite a ways. This one says March 27th, 2015. Oh, wow. So it's two years, three, almost three years. Wow. Oh, this is fun. Okay, you guys. Huh. There's, a, there's a lot more around here. It's like a, what do you call it? A um, scavenger hunt? Scavenger hunt, yeah. <laughs> So we're both new at this, so just in case you are, it's not exactly where it says it is on the app. It was about five feet away from from where it said, so not exactly accurate. And we did cover it back up. I wonder how you, uh... oops, log, log geo. Way, but we know how accurate it was last time. Ooh, that's a big one. <laughs> Just some scorpions and tarantulas. <laughs> how far we walked. Well, not too far. <laughs> Dan, what are you cooking? Nothing, I just open it up. Yeah. Here, I'll come over and uh, I wanted to show her to her. She was asking about something. Asking about one. She said, so you have a, a YouTube? She said, I heard Carolyn mention it yesterday. You did change it? Yeah, now I'm Blue, uh, Blue Van Dan. Blue Van Dan. So geocaching with Carolyn today was fun. It was uh, both of our first times doing it, and uh, we ended up finding two of them. The second one had no pet rock in it. It was just uh, the little log that came inside of two shotgun shells shoved inside each other. And it was in a pile of rocks also, like the first one. Um, but it was uh, fun, and we'll probably both do it again. Uh, today, my back is starting to feel better. Um, probably just a little bit of exercise helped me, since I had been kind of locked up in my van for a few days. Um, you know, I know that exercise usually helps, but unfortunately where we are, it's a lot of rocks and uneven ground, and it's just a little risky when your your back is all flared up. It's risky to go you know, rock walking on uh, uneven ground like that, it could actually make it worse. But today was good. I was careful and um, wore, I wore proper shoes and uh, yeah, it was nice. I appreciate you guys watching and I hope you guys have a good day. See you soon.